But this time next week, so a week from today, basically, mm. many of us will be waking up to start cooking or putting those final touches on our Thanksgiving meal. Yeah, and those who are in need of a meal that day can get one for free in Mount Vernon. Our Brooke Slyer is live with more details. Brooke? Yeah, good morning, Evie and Dave. Well, right now I made my way to a different part of Central Christian Church right here in Mount Vernon. And next week from 11 to 1.30, they'll be holding their Thanksgiving meal. And to tell me a little bit more about it this morning is Steve Reynolds. He is the man in charge of the Thanksgiving meal over here. So go ahead and tell me how this all works, because yet again this year, you guys are going to be doing a drive through to make it a little COVID friendly safe. Correct. Yeah, in years past, we've had uh, people that came in for a uh, for meal, sit down dinner, and uh, but because of COVID, we're not able to do that last year or this year. So it'll be uh, drive-through, and we'll also be making deliveries. And what will you be serving? Because you're telling me you guys are going to have all the fix-ins. It sounds pretty good. <laughs> yeah, it, it's your normal uh, traditional Thanksgiving dinner. It's got uh, turkey and dressing and mashed potatoes and gravy and green beans cranberry sauce, sweet potatoes, dinner rolls, and dessert. And what time do you wake up and get here to start preparing all this? Well, my, my morning starts about 3 a.m., so it's, uh, it's an early day, but there's always a lot of activity and everything going on on Thursday morning early. So we've got a lot of good volunteers that come in and try to help. And uh, so we uh, just try to pull everything together that morning, and uh, so we're able to uh, start uh, serving at, uh, at 11 o'clock. And you know, you guys put in, like you just mentioned, a lot of hard work to go ahead and put this, uh, you know, Thanksgiving dinner on, serving thousands of people. What does it mean to be able to provide that meal to someone who might not have a Thanksgiving otherwise? You know, that's, that's the, the key thing that keeps us going, is that there are people out there that don't have anyone to share a Thanksgiving meal with. Mm -hmm or they're down on their luck. So, you know, we've been able to suffice and, and take care of that need for 25 years. Well, and to be able to take care of that need, you know, you did mention that you need volunteers. So we will be talking about that a little later on in the show. But for now, I'm going to toss it back to you in the studio. And good Thursday morning.